He released from jail in a matter of hours after posting bail. We're also getting a glimpse tonight into the personality of the accused killer. 13 Action News reporter Annalise Ortiz has new information on this case. Do you understand your obligation to have to be truthful it, here? Well, yeah, but <laughs> nobody knows the Dr. Dr. Gregory Brent Dennis can be heard laughing in this deposition from last year. You think this is funny? Susan oh, Winters is dead. Do you think this is funny? Sir. Do you think this is funny? No, I do not. Okay. The no. interview was part of a civil trial against Dennis. Attorneys believe he poisoned his wife for money and because she allegedly threatened to expose his drug habit. During the deposition, he admits to using drugs. Could you have ingested cocaine two days ago? Possibly. But denies the rest. She said she was going to turn you in for using drugs. Fair? I don't have any recollection of that. Winter's death was originally ruled a suicide, but the case was reopened. Attorney Yvette Meningo says since then, the district attorney's office has uncovered more evidence of Dennis's alleged drug abuse. We were happy to see that the DA was able to uncover, I guess, some of the missing pieces that we were expecting. And although in this deposition he never admits to killing Winters, Meningo believes both trials will expose the truth. It's going to be very difficult for him to get around all this evidence and explain himself. Annalise Ortiz, 13 Action News.